Hi everyone, it's Adam here. I'm a photographer currently based in the UK. I shoot commercial and some travel work. Um, I'm also setting up a print shop, which I'll talk about more in the future. Um, so today we're looking at the Canon R6 firmware update. So if you type this into Google and then click on the first result, we'll take you over to the uh, Canon's page. Uh, it's a little bit quicker than searching for it on Canon. And then head over to the firmware tab. Okay, so once we're on the firmware tab, here you can see some different options. So this will give us the uh, the right firmware for either Mac or Windows, and also shows the date of the release for the firmware. You can also click on here and see what you're actually updating. Um, I think there's quite a few video updates recently. Um, I don't shoot too much video, um, but it's always good to keep your firmware updated. So here we go. So I'm going to click on download for Mac and it will give you the license agreement. And then you just download this to your downloads folder. Uh, make sure you click on save. Here we go. Okay, now take one of your memory cards. I tend to use one of my old memory cards and we're going to format this. So uh, place the card in your camera and then go to menu and go to the tool tab, the yellow tab, and go to, it's on tab one, and format card. So I just format that. Only takes a second, here we go. And then turn your camera off, and remove your card. Plug your card back into your computer. Take the file that you downloaded earlier, double click on this to open it, unpackage it then take the FIR file and drag it over to the memory card. Okay, eject your memory card. And then place the memory card back into your camera. Press the menu button, head back over to the yellow tool tab, and this time we are on tab number five, and go to firmware. You can see I'm on version 131 here. There we go. So the current firmware version is 131 update firmware. Okay. And then just leave this for a minute or two. And then you just push the set button on the turn wheel and you're all good to go. And one last thing, I just um, remember to take out the older memory card and put back in your two main ones. You, could, you can of course um, just use the same card, just reformat it, but um, I tend just to keep things separate, it just makes life simple for me. So there we go, if you enjoyed this video then please do uh, like and subscribe. Um, also check out my other video um, which has been quite popular, which is the two card slot trick. So you can shoot JPEG on one card and RAW on the other. Okay, all good to go. Thanks for watching.